Happy January 24th, everyone. I'm Liam, and we are playing the 2024 Quest Calendar by Sundial Games, the Leaf Riders of Renwood. Yesterday, Cora, Princess Cora, left her bedroom by the window and, in a dazzling display of athleticism, made her way out and down and across rooftops, swinging from banners, leaping from balconies, She's trying to escape boredom, the daily drudgery of being royalty, specifically a dress fitting, and so far she's been quite successful. We lost only one point of health in the escapade so far. Basically, we're winded and our muscles are a bit fatigued. Uh, so let's see where we're headed and what adventure is in store for us today. Okay. The castle is bustling with people in preparation for today's festival. The guards are on high alert. You need to sneak past them to avoid any suspicion. So we have a choice here in the beginning. We can try a disguise or we can cause a distraction. And then uh, after we choose one of those, we'll sneak around the guards or attempt to. So the disguise is a wisdom role and the distraction is an intelligence role um, we're not we're not we're uh, we're not great in either one of those we have a minus one in both both of them so let's say uh, one to ten we'll try a disguise eleven to twenty will cause a distraction we're causing a distraction okay the guards are talking. We just got orders from Captain Flint Clawthorne. Be on the lookout for Cora. She has snuck out of her room again. They found out about us already. Uh, you hear a familiar voice coming from around the corner. Sounds like Ryder and Bark. You guess they didn't get the day off like they requested. Okay, let's cause a distraction. D20 plus intellect, which is minus one. Plus two because we're stealthy. Add plus two to all rolls to sneak and remain hidden. So we get a d20 plus one. It has worked for you before. Bark always falls for a diversion. Get the guards to look elsewhere as you move past them. Six plus one is seven. If the result is 11 or less, too much is going on for a stray sound or visual anomaly to catch the guards' attention. All right, our distraction uh, either it didn't work or we couldn't come up with anything uh, in, in the hustle and bustle. So now we're going to try to sneak around the guards without the benefit of a distraction. That's a d20 plus dexterity. We've got a high dexterity, so plus two dexterity. And uh, stealthy, so another plus two, so d20 plus four. Two <laughs> plus four is six. There she is, you hear Ryder shout as he rushes towards you from down the hall. He's always taking his job too seriously. Ryder leaps into the air to try to tackle you to the ground. See combat below. Okay, we're in combat. Alright. If your attack roll equals or exceeds Ryder's defense you hit. I'm trying to hit him. <laughs> I don't know why it's cracking me up. We're in a fight for our life. Um, okay, we're going to attack. Our attack is plus three. Um, we can reroll Charisma. That's not going to help here. Once per rest, gain D6 bonus to all attack rolls on the page if we use Flurry, <laughs> flurry of Daggers. I don't know. Cora might go for it. She really doesn't want to go to this dress fitting rider. I think you're in trouble. <laughs> okay. If you're, here's our attack. D20. <laughs> 2 plus 3 is 5 his defense is here I'll pull up the stats so you can see this um, his defense is 11 <laughs> so we did not hit him we miss uh, if you miss Ryder might tackle you if your defense roll equals or exceeds Ryder's attack okay so now we roll defense our defense is plus 2 6 Plus two is uh, eight. 
Um, and his attack is 12. <laughs> no. Defense equals zero. You reduce your health. Otherwise, reduce your health by full damage, which is two. So we take two points of damage from being tackled by this guard. So we're down to eight. Where's my cloth here? Eight. This is, we had a better time climbing out that window yesterday. Um, let's see. Okay, so we, he tackled us. If Ryder tackled you, you slip out of his grasp, quickly dart around the corner, and take off running. Ryder looks up at you from the floor, clutching at his side. I don't know, maybe he's got a cramp because we didn't hurt him. <laughs> says, Ugh, I'm getting too old for this. Just be careful this time, would you? <laughs> yeah. Be careful, you're the one who tackled us, buddy. Oh, that's yesterday. Okay. All right. Well, we escaped the clutches of this um, highly conscientious and overambitious guard. Uh, oh, there's... Okay. On, <laughs> on our way out, I guess, we spot some hidden treasure. There's an icon on this page. If you spot it, you can roll on this table. We'll roll a ten-sided die and see what we found on our way out the door. Nimble cap. That's it. We haven't had nimble cap before. What is nimble cap? Nimble cap. Consumed on use adds d4 to dexterity on a single roll. Well, I guess we, we could have used that a moment ago. <laughs> We'll write nimble cap down here. Maybe nimble cap. <laughs> Pick a mushroom on the way out. All right. Good job. Good job, Cora. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll say goodbye for today and visit Cora and Jim again tomorrow. I hope you will join us. Thanks for watching.